And happening right now in El Grove, a messy cleanup after a truck carrying a paving mixture rolled and then splashed that sticky substance onto other cars and the roadway. Yeah, it's happening on El Grove Florin Road at Bond Road. Live Copter 3 is up over the scene. And KCRA 3's David Beenick is now on the ground with the drivers who were splashed. Bit of a sticky wicket there, David. Exactly, Galston. Take a look behind me. You can see this tanker truck that flipped over. The cleanup is underway. Most of the other vehicles that were damaged have been towed away. But imagine what it must have been like for those drivers sitting at this intersection when day suddenly turned to night. Crews use shovels and sand to try to mop up the black gooey mess that spilled and splashed all over this Elk Grove intersection this afternoon. I was here. parked here. I seen a truck coming, you know, making the turn and a big boom and an instant splash. The tanker truck was on the back of a trailer being towed by a dump truck that was turning onto Bond Road when the trailer flipped over. There's nothing we could do because the light was red and there were cars around, so. At least six cars were hit by the material, which Elk Grove police say is an overcoat, something between oil and tar. The driver of the car closest to the spill climbed out her passenger door, then walked through the spill in her sandals. I had to. <laughs> there was no other choice. What was that like? What, what is that material like? It's sticky and gross. Police say the material is not considered hazardous, but they still don't want to wash it down the sewer. Drivers called family members to say they're all right and called their insurance companies to try to explain. Do you think you can clean your car? Who, me? <laughs> or anybody? I think. Now, here is the truck that was towing the trailer that flipped. We're still waiting to find out if the driver of that truck is going to get a ticket for this. Meanwhile, the intersection here at uh, Elk Grove Floor and Road and Bond Road is expected to be closed for several hours. Live in Elk Grove, David Bean, KCRA 3 News.